Well, at Pauley Pavilion, UCLA concluded a busy week. Three games and five nights at open with the just a national attention-grabbing win over Arizona. It ends, though, with a game that was lacking an artistry, Don, <laughs> with 39 fouls called. But at the end, UCLA takes care of it and knocks off a Stanford team that was coming yeah. off a win at USC. And, and UCLA's defense was the, the first thing, which led to a lot of transition offense. They turned over Stanford time after time. They got the ball down the court and were able to score before the defense was set because UCLA didn't shoot it well tonight, but they manufactured offense in transition off of those steals and turnovers, built a big lead, and never looked back. That transition offense, so important. And Jules Bernard ends up being the UCLA leader in a game where Jaime Jaquez got hurt the first half, only played six minutes. Yeah. Bernard leads in both points and rebounds. Yeah, and no Johnny Juzang, remember, no Jalen Clark. So he they needed his production. He was up to the task. And Jake Kyman started the weekend having scored only 10 points on the season. He had 25 in two games. You got to give him credit that he stayed ready. He, he continues to work in case he gets his opportunity. He's getting it now. You don't know how long it's going to last, but for now, he really helped UCLA on Thursday night and then again tonight. And so for UCLA, they sweep the home week and sets up the second match with Arizona Thursday night. For Stanford, they go home. They'll play four straight at home starting Tuesday night against Cal.